to be used on new tracks, and Abbas Bjorn reckons AI could be a fantastic co-writer for artists. But others are more skeptical, with Drake recently having his vocals faked on an AI, AI song, and uh, Ed Sheeran has been vocal in his own warnings about AI. This is the, the issue I have with this is it's very difficult to feel sorry for artists mm -hmm. and, and actors, not because you know, they don't have genuine you know, complaints or anything like that, but because they're so far removed from the public, I feel. They're in such a bubble of an industry. You know, they, they tend to have different concerns from the average person. You're just like, this is not something I can really connect with. In the case of Hosier, who made one song, Take Me to Church, I don't know if you remember that song. I don't, I'd never heard of it. it. Exactly, because it was so long. I think it was well over a decade ago. Was it? Yeah, I mean, this man's yeah. song, one song, has been probably been remixed in clubs in Colombia mm. to some bachata song or some salsa song. Be like, take me to church. And that's probably the only, only people's recognition of that song. Or, you know, some South African club playing I'm a piano. I mean, he really has nothing to worry about here. I just think the issue is it's so far removed from the public that it yeah. seems a bit ridiculous. I don't think 